Katie and I'm here to show you how to set up your LAN on your Hytron router. Our engineer's already done most of the work and your service is ready to be used. All you need to do is attach your kit. First, find the yellow ports on the back of the router. You'll have been sent an ethernet cable as well. Plug one end into any of these ports and the other into your computer. Once it's connected, an LED will light up. If it's green, it'll only transmit at 100 meg. Try replacing either the cable itself or the kit on the other end of the cable. But if it's orange, it's one gig, which is ideal. Your computer should recognize this connection too, and now you're almost ready to go. However, if you've got a static IP, you'll need to do a little more configuration before you can get started. We'll come to that shortly. For now, just carry on with the setup. You'll need your administrator credentials. They're on a white label on the back. Open a browser and type in 192.168.0.1. Log in using your administrator credentials. Then go to basic, then LAN setup to change the internal range to whatever you need. Just make sure you don't use 192.168.100.1. This is reserved for modem mode. If you want DHCP reservation to reserve a specific IP, you'll find that here too. For those of you with single or multiple static IPs, now's the time for that additional configuration. Go to admin, then VMB IP service. Enter your details and then reboot the modem to apply the changes. If you make a mistake, you'll need to start the process again. Once it's complete, the GRE tunnel state should say connected. If this doesn't show at any point in the future, simply enter your authentication username and password and you'll be back online. Finally, you might need to know your WAN IP address. This is the address your router uses to connect to the internet. If you have a dynamic service, your WAN IP is found under status, then system information, then WAN. But if you've got a static address, it's under admin, then VMB IP service, then LAN default gateway IP. I hope this has helped. If you need anything else, why not check out our help and support pages or for more information, talk to us on live chat.